Right, so this is a stateroom tour. Uh, this room is 9598 on Freedom of the Seas. Um, so this is a junior suite um, and we've been here for a week. So I'm just going to show you the room. Um, you guys will probably remember if you've watched this before that we've had this exact same room number on the Independence, which is a sister ship. So it's literally identical to that, but we'll go through it anyway. So you have your um, assembly station information there. Um, you've got two hooks on the back of the door to hang up some coats or whatever you need to hang up. Um, to, when you're facing the door, to the right of the door, you have your bathroom. Excuse the mess, obviously we've been staying in here for about a week, so it's a little bit messy. Um, it's our last day, so we're in the process of packing. So, um, we have like a mirror and these side things open up. So you've got like some shelving space. Um, you've got your sink area and some shelving under there as well. You've got two bins and they provide you with some um, sanitary uh, bags. Um, they provide you with flannels to change like, every, all the time if you use them. Um, you also get some lotion, soft skin lotion, uh, which is quite cool. See, so it's like dry skin. Just really cool when you get free lotion. Um, obviously your toilet, towels, um, any dirty towels you put on the floor, they will change for you. Um, your shower area, which is with a curtain. Um, they give you soap, conditioner and shampoo all in there for you. Uh, so that's the bathroom. There's also hooks on the back of the door. There is a step, so be careful. On the other side, there is another door. This one is a walk-in wardrobe. So you have a bunch of shelving units um, there for you. So you've got a load of shelving units and your life jackets are in there too. You've got a bunch of hanging space, place for your trousers, and you've also got a lot of floor space as well for your cases, so you can hide them away. Or you can put your cases under the bed as well if you wanted to. Um, you've got a long, large mirror. You've got a bedside table with no plugs, but you've got like a little light there, but you've got a drawer and a shelf unit. Um, over here, you've got um, a few more shelves and a safe as well. Then you've got your desk area. So these here open up and you've got more shelves. There's shelves on both sides. Uh, plugs, you have a European plug here. So that one's a European plug. Um, that's how you control your announcements, the volume of your announcements. Um, here is um, some more plugs. So you've got two US plugs. Uh, this one controls the lighting just here. Um, but you've got two US plugs. Um, you've also got a USB um, on your TV as well. So if you need an extra place to charge, you have got a USB on your um, TV. So that's good. So you've got a lot of bunch of drawers um, space and your mini fridge is under here. Um, in the junior suite, you get a coffee machine um, and coffee as well. Um, that's a medical fridge we've got extra, but you can ask your room attendant and they'll give that to you. The TV does move to wherever you want to look at it. And um, that's just the time animals we've got. And they've got a little shelving unit there. Um, and you've got like a little seat that has like a, um, a puffet. So you can rest your legs up. Um, it's a sofa bed, so it pulls out to a double bed in the evening. Um, so that pulls up there. Um, another best side of the cabinet. There's no plugs on this side either. But they do have a USB port in the phone, which you can charge stuff in. And they've got space under the bed for suitcases or whatever. Um, as it's a junior suite, you get a large balcony. So you get a longer balcony. Um, it's very hot out there. We're at sea today, it's our last day. So I won't go on the balcony, but you get two, um, two chairs and a table and then two lounges, which is really nice. You can sit there on a sunny day and sunbathe if you want to. Um, the doors also open up, so if you want to connect to the room next door, you can do to make it an even larger balcony, so you can also do that as well. Um, so that is a room, you get a lot of floor space, it's nice and big, so if you just want like a, um, a starter suite to get two double points, but you don't want to spend too much, this is quite ideal for you. Um, it's quite spacious, so it's good for like three people, um, nice and spacious, obviously you get your walking wardrobe as well, so you've got plenty of storage space. 
Um, so yeah, if you've got any questions, um, put them in the comments and I'll do my best to get back to you as soon as possible. Um, it can be about anything, it can be about the ship, it can be about the room, um, whatever you need to ask. Uh, yeah, I will happily answer that for you. Alright, take care.